when I was 16, I remember slipping out one Sunday night. It was this time of year, the beginning of August. And Bernie and I met at the gate of the workhouse. And the pair of us off to a dance in Art Straw. I was being pestered by a fellow called Tim Carlin at the time. But it was really Brian McGuinness that I was that I was keen on. I remember Brian with the white hands and the longest eyelashes you ever saw. But of course he was crazy about Bernie. Anyhow, the two boys took us on the bar of their bikes and off the four of us headed to Ard Straw, 15 miles each way. If Daddy had a known. May you rest in peace. And at the end of the night, there was a competition for the best military two-step. And it was down to three couples, the local pair from Ard Straw, we, Timmy and myself, he was up to there and me, and Brian and Bernie. And they were just so beautiful together. So stylish. You couldn't take your eyes off them. People just stopped dancing and gazed at them. And when the judges announced their winners, they were probably blind drunk. Naturally, the local couple came first. Myself and Timmy came second. And Brian and Bernie came third. Poor Bernie was stunned. She couldn't believe it, couldn't talk, wouldn't speak to any of us for the rest of the night, wouldn't even cycle home with us. She was right too. They should have won. They were just so beautiful together. That's the last time I saw Brian McGuinness. I remember Brian with the... Next thing I heard, he left for Australia. She was right to be angry, Bernie. They should have won. Must have been blind drunk, those judges, whoever they were.